Hello guys! Today, as I already mentioned in my previous vlog, I want to invite you for a fashion vlog. What's new in my wardrobe for autumn and winter. If you follow me on Instagram, you know that I mainly share fashion content and therefore, as I previously mentioned in one of my vlogs, I really want to combine those two platforms together. So here and there, um, add some fashion related videos. So. I hope you enjoy this content. These items I've been collecting since September, so it's not like I bought them all now, but majority of them, they will be still available. So I will leave all the links in the description below and let's see what I bought. So at first, I'm gonna show you the cardigan that I'm wearing. It's a cardigan from Zara in this beautiful cable knit pattern. These details, the buttons, and also here, it's a beautiful, super soft cardigan because it's mainly made of viscose. And yeah, because of its fabric, it won't keep us warm during winter, but it's definitely great for autumn or for layering. I see it in many different outfits, either for those corporate looks or for more casual looks with jeans. I, of course, will show you some of the outfit ideas. And because the color is very universal, it will match a lot of stylings. I'm wearing a size medium and normally in those basic knitted tops from Zara, I do wear medium. I bought it some time ago, but I've seen it on the website the other day, so I hope it's still available, but of course I will link it down below. Another item, it's also a cardigan and it's also from Zara. I still have the label because until I'm 100% sure, I always keep the label in case if I have to return it. And yes, I have decided to keep it, but I still haven't um, worn it, so that's why the label is still here. And I actually showed you this cardigan already when I was styling my lily silk trousers in the previous vlog. Made of 100% wool and considering it's wool, it wasn't even that expensive. It was £50 and I'm not sure whether you're going to see it properly, but the fabric is quite thick. But at the same time, it's very soft. I also wear it in size medium. It's a beautiful grey cardigan with this round neck. It will definitely keep me warm during winter because it's made of wool. I don't have a style like that cardigan in my wardrobe, therefore I'm really happy with it. I will of course show you some of the outfit ideas. Another item is this jumper from H&M this time. This jumper went viral and it was sold out within literally five minutes, but luckily some sizes appeared and I was able to buy extra small because it has this um, oversized fit, so extra small is still quite loose. It's a wool and mohair blend. If you see the fabric, it's this hairy fabric and it is a bit itchy, unfortunately, but in the winter, I normally wear long sleeves under those jumpers anyway, so yeah. But if you don't mind itchiness, then this jumper is beautiful. And because of its oversized fit, I love wearing it with leggings, chunky boots, but also it will look beautiful with jeans or a satin skirt, which I will show you later in the vlog because I also bought a satin skirt. Because it's made of wool and mohair blend, it will definitely keep me warm during winter. The fabric is nice and thick and I really love the color. So yeah, definitely will match a lot of stylings. And another item is this beautiful skirt from N Other Stories. And I'm not sure whether you remember, but in my getting ready for autumn vlog, I showed you that blazer from N Other Stories. So this is a matching skirt to that blazer, which I haven't seen in the shop. I only just saw it on H&M website because H&M is selling now and other stories, as you probably know. So yeah, they recently uh, got 20% off. So this is where I got it from. And I really love this skirt. This is completely my style. And I love wearing mini skirts during autumn or winter with like loafers or chunky boots. I love the color as well and this dog tooth pattern. It's made of 70% of wool, therefore it's great for autumn and winter. Even though it's a mini skirt, it's not like it will keep me warm, but yeah, it's definitely better than polyester. And I still don't know what to do with that blazer, whether I should order it or not, 
but I definitely plan to keep this skirt. Another item, it's also a skirt, but this time from H&M, and this is the satin skirt, the one that I told you about. Can you see? So this skirt is made of viscose, and I have to say, I've been planning to buy a skirt like that for a long time, but I was planning to buy a silk skirt, and as I told you in the previous vlog, silk is quite expensive, so I was kind of like, okay, maybe next season, maybe next season, until H&M came up with the viscous version of this skirt, and even though I was kind of planning to get a midi skirt, this one's a maxi skirt, and I really love it actually, and I think with skirts like that, they're very versatile and you can style them throughout the year. In the summer with the linen shirt, in the winter with boots. Even now, during this festive season, you can really style it up really nicely. And of course, I'll show you some of the outfit ideas. So yeah, really happy with the fact that I didn't have to spend more money on it. And yeah, maybe in the future, um, but for now, definitely, I'm happy with this one. Another item is this beautiful blazer from Zara, the one that you have already seen in my previous vlog. And I have to say, when I ordered that blazer, I wasn't sure whether I should keep it. And now, it's been my most worn blazer for the last two weeks. So yeah, definitely happy that I kept it. It's a beautiful blazer, beautiful color. It has this um, herringbone... Um, pattern yeah really happy with it it has this slight oversized fit so I went for a size small even though I did think about getting a size extra small but with the thick jumper it was a bit uncomfortable so yeah I went for a size small really happy with it I see it styling in many different outfits with leggings, chunky boots or jeans. Even with um, the other day I went to work and I had it with my um, smart trousers. Really love it, it's a perfect blazer for autumn and winter, either to wear it on its own or under a coat. Uh, made of 60% of wool, therefore it's slightly thicker and yeah. Really love the color, really love the fabric. And another item is this beautiful pea coat from Arquette. And I have to say, it's a lot heavier than the blazer that I was holding. I mean, I can definitely feel the difference. But yeah, Arquette is well known from its quality. I mean, you can definitely feel the difference. I'm not sure whether you'll be able to see it, but yeah, it's a lot thicker. It's made of 80% of wool, even though it's unlined, you can, as I said, you can feel the quality and yeah, it's a, you know, cropped short coat, so it's not like it will keep you super warm in the winter, but to be honest, I was looking for a short coat, um, sometimes with those long coats can be a bit uncomfortable, so yeah, I just need something easy to put on and, and to feel comfortable when I'm shopping, when I'm driving. It has this slight oversized fit. I already styled it with leggings, with jeans, even with knitted dress. But I also see it with this wide leg trousers that I showed you last time. I also bought this coat on H&M website. So yeah, really good price for the quality of the coat. I will of course show you some of the outfit ideas with it. Yeah, really love it. And another coat is from End Other Stories this time. This is the one that I already showed you in Getting Ready for Autumn vlog. And I'm not sure whether you remember, but I really liked it in the shop and I was considering whether I should buy it. So yeah, in the end I bought it. I'm really happy with it. It has this beautiful light brown color. Even though sometimes I feel like the color changes <laughs> for some reason. But yeah, it's this unlined, as I previously mentioned, unlined coat. Um, it's made of, I think, 60% of wool. So yeah, it's slightly thinner than the one from Arquette. Um, it has a belt. Yeah, I really love this coat. 
you can really style it down or up and the other day i styled it with the blazer from zara so yeah i had the blazer this coat on i felt nice and warm and i also bought this coat on h&m website so yeah it was also slightly discounted i think 15 percent or 20 percent so yeah really happy with it i'll show you some of the outfit ideas of course and another item are these jeans from zara in this dark wash it's a close up they have a straight leg and they're true to size and i know that in zara sometimes it's difficult to know which size to order but they're definitely true to size i think with this color of jeans you can either dress them down or up i think in general jeans are one of those must have items in your wardrobe so yeah these are perfect i'll show you of course some of the outfit ideas love the color love the fit um, they're high-waisted again those jeans were on a special price recently so I'll definitely link them down below and I hope they're still available and at the end I've got those two pair of loafers to show you so let me start with this one these beautiful loafers are from Zara they're suede loafers in this beautiful camo tone yeah, I really like their color with this gold buckle at the front yeah they're very lightweight i mean of course it's getting cold now so of course they won't be perfect for now but in general really happy with them they were only 50 pounds and they will be perfect for autumn and spring really can't wait to style them i will of course show you some of the outfit ideas yeah they will match perfectly my camo coat and all the camo items in my wardrobe yeah really happy with them perfect loafers these on the other hand are slightly more chunky they from vagabond i bought them maybe over a month ago and again like with the blazer i've been wearing them on repeat even though when i bought them i wasn't sure whether i should keep them so yeah really happy with them they've got this polished leather and even though they're slightly more chunky than the other ones, they're still very subtle. So yeah, I've been looking for um, loafers like that for quite some time because I need it to match exactly as I said, jeans, trousers, even a skirt. And they've been perfect. I'll show you a little close up. So yeah, even though they're a bit more chunky but as i said they still subtle enough to wear them with the skirt and of course this is vagabond so they are slightly more expensive but to be honest i will be wearing them quite a lot and therefore cost per wear becomes quite low so i'm really happy that i got them and i'll show you some of the outfit ideas in a cutaway so this is it guys i really hope you like this vlog let me know in the comments which items you like the most i hope i'll see you in the next one guys bye